Now, it's not uncommon for the children of sportsmen and women to follow in their parents' footsteps. Think about Nigel and Brian Clough, Graham and Damon Hill, Chris Eubank Sr. and Junior. Well, the both family now have had three generations represent their country. Sir Ian's grandson, Jim, played for Wells under 18s in their defeat by England yesterday. The young Botham is the son of Sir Ian's son, Liam, who played both cricket and rugby professionally. He qualifies for Wells as he was born in Cardiff while his dad was playing for the Blues and he was supported by Liam, his dad, at the game uh, in Swansea. And the Bothams weren't the only famous sporting family in action. James Grayson, son of former England fly half Paul, scored 21 points as England uh, managed to get a comfortable win. So what's it like then for the young Botham trying to emulate the success of both dad and granddad? I don't think it's actually that difficult. If anything, it gets me more fired up because people try and give you a little bit of chit chat about it, and I, I, it gets me more fired really. And it doesn't bother me. At the end of the day, I go out, get my red jersey on, when I zone out, I just focus on the game. I don't care what anyone else says. I don't think about anything. Just get on with it, really, and then see how it comes. It's just one of those things you get on with. He's a generation on, um, but it's still the interest there with the both the name. And uh, but he'll deal with that. You know, I've got no problem. Um, you know, and um, he, he'll just he'll just get on. It's just water off a duck's back, and um, he has all the support from us as a family, and also support from here in Wales. You know, I had the decision when I was Wales, and you know, Dad takes keeps giving me a drive. So look, Jimbo's going to go and, and do it in Wales. That's what you should have done. We're a very close family, um, and obviously he's he's very very proud. Uh, Jimbo, being um, you know um, his grandson and coming down to watching, he's super proud of him.